So when they say Odogu is the biggest in the music industry, so many people would doubt and call their own goods. Well, this is not about, oh, Whiskey and Davido are actually the biggest. Bonaboy has no place in the industry because the fact is, a whole lot of Nigerian musicians are killing these shows out there. And trust me, I'm not going to lie you. These Nigerian guys, they try. If you go to London, them day there. If you go Amsterdam, them day. If you go Netherlands, them day. If you go different countries, a whole lot of them day, they perform for how many thousand capacities and they are still doing well. You see, one thing with greatness is greatness has no timing. The moment it reach your turn, you go shine. And you fit the shine for even 20 years for the music industry. You know, easy, you make way to not forget say today out there, not be easy thing. And these days, Nigerian musicians are taking over from their American counterparts by covering shows of 40,000, 80,000, 200,000 capacity crowd. And a lot of them are still giving their best performances. How do they do this? How do they migrate from being maybe one of the musicians in the industry who were not respected back in the days because of looking at where they are coming from? How did they evolve to this stage? Well, dreams come true and trust me, one could improve on the things they are doing to make a better life for themselves. Everything has to do with practice. If you practice, trust me, if you day on the right path, you practice, you improve, you add more to yourself. At the end of the day too, now you go still shine. Hmm. Our Nigerian musician, Borna Boy, decided to shock his fans with his own performance on the city field. Not be smart in way Borna Boy do. That city field stadium as he fool like that. Bonaboy decided to charge and change the game in the music industry. I still they ask between Bona, Whiskey and Davido, who has the best performance so far? One will say it's Whiskey, another will say it's Davido. One will say Bonaboy has the best. But so far, I think I've seen um, reviews from fans, and a lot of them have concluded that in the Nigerian music industry, in terms of performances, Bonaboy has the greatest of them all. Do you really think Bonaboy has the greatest performances in the music industry? Well, rush down to our comment section to drop your own opinion, and you're welcome to this channel once again. Bona has really transformed himself in the music industry, and it shows that there's nothing that the mind cannot achieve if we set ourselves to our goals and commit to changing and improving our own self in terms of whatever field we pick in life. Now, Bonaboy has really come a long way, and although people like to compare him to the likes of Davido, yet he's really shown us that he cannot be compared to anyone in the music industry based on the fact that he's not here for luxury or for show off. He's here for the music and to also give this, his fans a good time. Bonaboy shut down City Field stadium in new york city and this time around bona wows the crowd but before i bring on this story make una not forget to follow us on instagram facebook twitter and tiktok also like our post on facebook and for more updates click on the red subscribe button and hit the notification bell if you think this music business is easy, well, step inside this musician's shoes. Then you know that sometimes you could be in this same industry and you fit no blue. During his performance in the City Field Stadium, a lot of things happened. Now, the City Field is based on 45,000 capacity, and even a fan testified that Bonaboy sold out and he killed it, and the fan also said, this capacity 40 something thousand and Bonner boys still managed to get to give them a show for their money well according to Bonner boy he really thanked his fans after everything and he said i am truly speechless last night was a movie and he decided to bring a show off 
of the places and top places for that matter that he's performed in in New York City. He said, New York with the Statue of Liberty. He said, PlayStation Theater in 2017. Gra Gramercy Theatre in 2018, The Apollo in 2019, Madison Square Garden in 2020, and now in 2023, he has the City Field Stadium. What a journey. Glory be to God, according to Bonaboy, because he know easy. Now, let's look at the way he even ushered himself into the system. His mother was seen praying for Bonaboy seriously before he bounced into the crowd to perform for them and before you know what they happened immediately bonaboy started performing we saw the likes of american rapper buster rhyme cheering bonaboy and he even sat close to bonaboy well we noticed that during bonaboy shows he usually promotes his fellow musicians in the industry like one time he promoted a shaker during his london show and this time he was seen promoting the like of whiskey show on his own concert not be smart you know he's really dominating the industry because he knows what to do and he's doing it very very well looking at bonaboy's performance at the city field now let's look at the theme the stage design and everything represents the love damini album and the way bonaboy ushered this particular theme and the setup really excited his fans he brought in a show when he introduced his unique fashion sense and he even dashed a fan his own sunglasses during his performance because he could not hide the, his excitement and based on the fact that the way the fans really responded to him rendering so many of his anthems he invited the likes of Dave Santana to perform on stage on the hit song that he was featured, Location. Now, after that, so many people were seen vibing to his own music and Bonaboy showed that he is the biggest in the music industry. Well, we too, we no go fit the Nyan because say, uh, we don't get other people to with the industry. Bonaboy too don't really try for a lot of people, especially for this music industry. People started hyping him as the greatest and trust me, in the music industry, this Bonaboy latest performance, we never see him before. Because of his city field stadium performance, well, his song Last Last re entered the category, especially the Apple Music Top 25, the New York version. Bonaboy is really doing well for himself in the music industry. You know, easy. People will go there, look and like say it easy. You know, easy. This city field way, see so now up to 40 something thousand capacity and this particular stadium now baseball stadium where they located for new york and top top teams they can watch match for this particular stadium hmm. not be small money where they don't invest for this particular property where bonaboy go perform so as they say to even make this buildings this building structure stand like they don't spend 1.23 billion us dollar for 2022 and you can imagine someone like bonaboy gracing that particular stage ah he's made a lot of things possible especially showing people that dreams actually do come true now let's look at the way he's being received we know we have other musicians like the likes of Whiskey and Davido and other people, Rema, who seems to be trending. But let's not forget that Bonaboy is actually doing his best in the music industry. And trust me, he's not even out here to chase clouds or anything. To me, he's just out here to deliver the good music and go his own way. From the stage settings to the crowd to the way he was received by the fans and he even sold out and to show you say bonaboy too they really do well the prayers and everything buster i was seen vibing a lot of people attended bonaboy's show waiting person no go really see hmm. the last london show we saw a lot of american and british 
actors, musicians, so many people present at Bona Boy Show. It shows that Bona is extremely influential in the music industry. Well, I just can't tell you now how it be for Bona Boy Show, how people like Buster Rhymes and a lot of people to follow turn up, and how Bona Boy used that opportunity to promote other people's um, tours in the music industry. And because of the way him song Sweet, well, one fan decided to say Bonner Boy marry me. She even proposed to Bonner Boy. You know how these fans them they follow duties because them no fit take them again and Bonner Boy to be bust their head. Who is Bonner Boy in this music industry that he's dominating the likes of Whiskey, Davido and Rema all together? What's so special about him? And my own question is why are nigerian musicians dominating the western world in terms of entertainment and they are covering top shows that even these westerners cannot cover some of these western stars cannot even sell out at these top arenas that our nigerian musicians are selling out like this yet ninja stars are really shining who do you think is dominating the music industry in terms of sales and performance, especially performance? Is it Whiskey? Is it Bonner Boy? Is it Davido? Or is it Rema? Rush down to our comment section to drop your own opinion, but Bonner Boy made a lot of fans went crazy during his City Field show last night.